Hey, Bob Deeks here from RDC Fine Homes uh, up here in beautiful Whistler, British Columbia. Uh, I am at our Bear Creek uh, Energy Step Code 4 house. It's been a bit of a while since uh, we've done a bit of an update here. As you can see, winter uh, is starting to arrive, a little bit of snow on the ground. Uh, today we're going to have a look at the uh, structural steel erection and uh, our radon mitigation uh, has uh, complete, just waiting for concrete there. Uh, steel guys should be here shortly and we'll get a short video of the steel getting flown in. Uh, right now let's go uh, up onto the main floor and we'll have a bit of a look at some of the steel structure that's going in place. Uh, we are one week away from uh, the trusses arriving uh, and finally getting a lid uh, on the project here. So what you're looking at here is uh, all the shoring uh, that is going in place. Uh, for our quad deck uh, and that is an insulated structural slab that will go on the roof of the garage and suite here uh, to support the uh, landscaping uh, that will eventually go on top to uh, somewhat hide the, the garage element of this four-story structure here. Uh, boys are uh, making good progress on getting all the shoring up and we are about a week or so away from installing the quad deck and pouring the concrete slab. So just uh, in here on the main floor, having a look at the uh, radon mitigation install here. Uh, that gold fabric you can see is radon block from Radon Environmental. If you look closely, you can see, see that it is uh, sealed around all our penetrations here. One, to prevent any ingress of uh, radon gas, and then it's also acting as our air barrier underneath our slab, which is really important for our overall air tightness. So you can see that gray tape sealed around uh, all the penetrations. And then uh, these uh, forms that you see in the slab, uh, that's there uh, to uh, pour a slightly lower slab in the bathrooms. So when the tile setter comes in, they can uh, custom slope uh, all the showers. So they'll build up the, the balance of the slab work in there when they apply their tile. Well, good shot down there. Uh, black tusk cranes just setting up uh, to start lifting in the second load of steel here. They should be done at the end of the day. Uh, down on the ground there, you can just see all the steel lined up. Uh, some really big beams and some more HSS posts ready to go. Uh, shout out to Sea to Sky Welding and Bob the Welder for a great team effort here uh, to get this stuff fabricated and uh, make sure it all fits. Uh, so looking forward to... Uh, successful day here get all the rest of the steel in place and uh, then uh, looking forward to uh, trusses showing up uh, next Tuesday and uh, finally getting a roof on this uh, just in time uh, for the winter snow so hopefully we're gonna see some warmer temperatures this week the snow will melt uh, and uh, we'll be well on our way to moving on inside uh, during the colder months here. Stay tuned for the next update next week when the trusses arrive.